Hey guys, Alex Weaver here with Ross Chastain at Talladega Super Speedway. I know that you like Super Speedways. You finished third in the truck series in Daytona and you won an Xfinity car, but you haven't raced on track at Talladega in a truck since 2016. Does that hurt your chances? I don't think so. I think it's, it's luck of the draw. I probably would have crashed those other times if I would have been here, so I'll, I'll, I'm glad I took those years off. Now, looking at your season as a whole, how do you feel coming into, you have six guys that are vying for the title, you're going for a championship, and I know that you, in the middle of the season, decided to go over the truck series, so how did you feel, what caused you to make that decision, and then talk me through if you think you're a championship contender. I was scared to death when it got you know, presented to me when, when the <laughs> ultimatum was there to do it. Um, and it really wasn't anybody's doing. Nobody made, nobody set out with that plan. There was just a lot of things that didn't work out on, on a bunch of different business sides. And, and all of a sudden it was apparent that there was no other option other than to go truck race. And that meant we could go run the triple truck challenge races and it yeah. just, it was the best thing. So um, Al Nice was, you know, on me all year to do it. And so were all my boys and girls on this Nice Motorsports <laughs> team. So when we did it, I felt like even if we just went to those triple truck challenge races and won one or two of them, it was going to be a success. Yeah. We won two and they took one back, but that's okay. And then from there, uh, we went executed at Pocono. We brought the fastest truck to Michigan and Vegas and, and all these places and we put ourselves in, in position to win. So absolutely, I think we are a championship contender, but I want all those other guys to think that they are and let everybody that's won races recently think that they're the favorite. A three week break, you guys are now beginning the second round of the playoffs, so does the mindset switch over? Is there a little more pressure now? How do we feel going into the second round? Actually, less pressure. I was more... Said no driver ever, by the way. Yeah. Just, I think it's more pressure as it no, gets closer. No, I was more, I was under, I had more sleepless nights about just winning another race to make it into the playoffs, and we did that, and then it was like, oh, well, the rest will be easy if we do that. So. Uh, no, we've got we've had such fast race trucks. We're bringing our Bristol truck back to Martinsville. Um, other than that, though, uh, our Martinsville Phoenix Homestead. You know, whether we're in it at Homestead or not, like looking at those three races, we'll have a shot to have the fastest truck every week with the car show. Well, you've now been in the truck, out on track. So keys to getting around this beast of a place. Hold the wheels straight, and steady. <laughs> Don't yet. wreck. Don't be the guy that messes up. That somebody's gonna mess up. I know it happens. You know, I. No ill will if it happens, you know, and I could be the one that, that does it. I could be the one that makes a mistake. These trucks don't drive great. They're not made to go this fast for this long a time on this hard of a tire. So I'm looking forward to the challenge of it. All right, well, Ross Chastain will go after the challenge here at Talladega. Coming up Saturday, he will take on the rest of the field, still vying for a championship title in the Gander Outdoors Truck Series. Saturday, 1.30 p.m. at Best Line.